Hey everybody. Today we're covering some of the most important vocabulary in all of stats. We'll talk about population and sample, parameter and statistic. So let's jump right in with the first two. A population is all the data of interest in a study. Observations, responses, measurements, and so on. And a sample is just a subset of that population. So, for example, imagine a political poll where a company contacts 1,200 voters at random, asking who they intend to vote for. The sample is going to be the list of preferences of those 1,200 individuals, while the parameter is going to be the list of preferences of all registered voters. Technically, population and sample both refer to those preferences, not to the individuals themselves. In general, we're not able to collect data from an entire population just from a sample. The point of inferential statistics is to use sample data to draw conclusions about populations. Two more essential definitions. First of all, a parameter is a number describing a population. Second of all, a statistic is a number describing a sample. So going back to that example, with a poll of 1,200 registered voters, suppose that 38% say they plan to vote for candidate A. The number 38% is a statistic. It's describing the sample. The corresponding parameter would be the percentage of all registered voters who intend to vote for candidate A. Um, typically, we only know the statistic, but ultimately we don't care about the statistic. We aren't interested, really, in the preferences of those 1,200 voters. We are interested in the parameter, but of course, we can't know the parameter. Two more examples. Number one. The average age of 50 randomly selected registered vehicles from the New York BMV was 8 years. So the population is going to be all vehicles registered with the New York BMV. I'm sorry, the ages of all vehicles registered with the New York BMV. And the sample is going to be the ages of the 50 randomly selected vehicles. The parameter is going to be the average age of all registered New York vehicles. And the statistic will be the average age of the 50 randomly selected ones. Example 2. The median household income in the United States in 2018 was $63,937. In Chicago that same year, the median household income was $70,760. So here the population is going to be the incomes of all households in the United States in 2018, and the sample is going to be the incomes of households in Chicago in 2018. The first number, 63,937, is a parameter. It describes the population. And the second number, 70,760, is a statistic, a number describing a sample.